with its sleek and sophisticated appearance. Tesla's very majestic beauty will captivate anyone in an instant. Fun fact, on a recent episode with comedian Jim Brewer, podcast host Joe Rogan, who's renowned worldwide, expressed his admiration for Tesla's new Cybertruck design. Uh, the two talked about why Rogan believes the Cybertruck will be the reason Tesla explodes. Uh, if you're interested in what he said, stick with us through to the very end. The Cybertruck is unlike any other car on the market, and it stands out in a big way thanks to its amazing and distinctive design. Its uh, features are also quite amazing. The vehicle is renowned for its remarkable appearance, unrivaled material selection, and Joe Rogan, who may be the Cybertruck's biggest fan. Tesla and the Cybertruck have long been favorites of Joe Rogan. The famous podcaster also had the opportunity to to talk with Elon Musk about the truck and Tesla in general with him numerous times, even in the most recent instance with Jordan Peterson. He and Rogan discussed all the possible powers of Tesla's Cybertruck. However, the most recent remarks from Joe Rogan Center on the truck's capabilities and Rogan's excitement for the future vehicle are drawn from his talk with comic gem brewer since Cybertruck came out Joe has also been a very ardent supporter of the vehicle in January, 2022. He even had the opportunity to see the prototype and guess what he even got to drive the real life version of the car. He posted some images of the electric pickup truck prototype and his thoughts about visiting the Giga factory in Austin on his Facebook page. After getting experience with the cyber truck prototype, he called it the coolest car and mentioned how it is insanely attractive in real life. He added that the Tesla cyber truck feels like a huge leap into the future, even though it occurred in 2022. Joe Rogan still harbors the same first romantic feelings for this beast a year later. During his conversation with Brewer, Rogan highlights a number of significant features of the Cybertruck, such as its stainless steel body paneling, dynamic suspension system, and overall superb design, which he believes will surpass many competitors. Given that the Cybertruck has had more than 1.5 million pre-orders, Rogan believes that its off-road capabilities and indestructible paneling will also appeal to owners of traditional trucks. Additionally, he asserted that Tesla wouldn't be able to meet demand for Cybertrucks with the amount produced. And guess what? When asked which car he would choose to own forever, Joe Rogan replied, a Tesla. But he also mentioned his issues with the car's charging ports. He said, if I can only have one car, uh, it might be the Tesla because it's like so easy to drive. But the charging thing is that I don't have one at my house and I didn't have one here. Like if I lived in an apartment and I couldn't get charged anywhere, despite this minor issue. Rogan, still, it's undoubtedly the coolest looking car I've ever seen. If you see it in pictures, it looks badass. But if you see it in person, you realize how big this thing is. Then you get in it. It's Gorgeous, not going to lie. The podcaster posted a picture of the vehicle on his Instagram page describing how it looks like it's from 100 years in the future when you're standing next to it. Rogan is absolutely correct when he says that the Tesla Cybertruck is a unique electric pickup truck that breaks with conventional wisdom in terms of automotive architecture. The entire interior of the Tesla Cybertruck is made of a paper composite material, which is not only extremely strong, but also environmentally friendly. When heated, the composite paper material takes on. Well, a serious appearance resembling marble. That is unique to the interior of the Cybertruck. Am I right or am I right? The advantages of the Tesla Cybertruck extend beyond its appearance. Unmatched value for money is one of the Tesla Cybertruck's greatest financial benefits. The triple motor Cybertruck has a driving range of more than 500 miles on a single charge. And Tesla is thinking of selling solar panels that would increase that range to up to 40 miles each day. Additionally, electric vehicles don't require routine engine maintenance or oil changes, top up gear oil, greasing, etc. This is a major benefit of the Tesla Cybertruck and most other electric cars, which reduces expenses and time. Off-roading abilities are also on more a primary factor in consumers favoring trucks over sedans or sports vehicles, Elon Musk says that the Tesla Cybertruck will come in three trim levels, two of which will be all wheel drive versions. Uh, he also says that the torque handling and performance of the truck will be able to go off road and match or surpass that of most exotic sports cars like the Porsche 911. Guess who agrees with this statement? Uh, Joe Rogan. He also once told his guest Jack Carr in a uh, podcast that no other car could match the power of a Tesla. 
He said that while Teslas are pretty effing amazing, he has the newest model S Plaid, which is ridiculously fast. It goes from zero to 60 MP in just 1.9 seconds and is a four door sedan with a very calm appearance. Um, it looks like a family automobile. That vehicle is the fastest one I own. I own race cars, very fast vehicles. I, my Porsche 91 Getty three is a vehicle with plaid leaves that leaves other Porsche cars in the dust. The interesting thing is that despite the features being added, Tesla hasn't made an effort to hide the cyber truck. In fact, it would have been challenging to do so given that the company unveiled the monster years ago and everyone is familiar with its appearance. So people are cautious about making changes to the many prototypes. Uh, most recently at Tesla's annual shareholder event, the company unveiled a new cyber truck. Ken gave a close up view of the most recent prototype which is regrettably, despite numerous recent sightings of the electric truck in what is allegedly close to production ready state. Uh, the exclusive stainless steel plating of the Cybertruck, which is frequently compared to the DeLorean. DMC 12 is expected to make the vehicle significantly more durable than its aluminum based counterpart. Elon Musk and Tesla have remained silent on the much anticipated truck, but a few features and specs are known, all of which are expected to fascinate customers and turn the truck into a sales phenomenon in its first year off the manufacturing line. You know, the truck sounds like it came straight out of a James Bond movie set with impenetrable glass uh, and even the capacity to forge through open water. All right, we'll always include the Ford F-150 Lightning and the upcoming Chevy Silverado AV. The Tesla Cybertruck's translucent exterior makes it incredibly aerodynamic, thus it will definitely be far more successful at reducing drag than a traditional truck. The vehicle's robust air suspension is another fantastic feature. In other words, the uh, vehicle's flat front serves as an air splitter to provide somewhat smooth airflow over the Cybertruck. For context, if you don't know what Beja is, it's the Mexican off-road motorsport event known as the Bat 1000, which takes place annually on the Baja California Peninsula and features a variety of off-road ready cars, trucks, motorcycles, ATVs, and buggies. The, the company CEO, Elon Musk, had previously mentioned raising and lowering suspension four inches in either direction for easy access to Cybertruck or the vault while self-leveling capabilities, adapt to every occasion and assist with every job. I guess we'll have to wait for the Beige to see out how the Cybertruck does. Uh, additionally, Elon Musk stated that the Tesla Cybertruck may achieve a drag coefficient of 0 0.30. To put that into perspective, the Ram 1500 model currently holds the record for the best drag coefficient of a pickup truck, which is a pitiful 0 0.36. Uh, do you uh, think the Cybertruck can beat that score? If there's one question that always crosses our minds when we think about the Cybertruck, it has to be its production. According to the quarter one 2023 update letter, Tesla will start producing the Cybertruck this summer or later this year. Elon Musk stated on the most recent earnings call that a Cybertruck handover event should occur by the end of quarter three 23, indicating that the first trucks will be delivered to clients at that time. However, Tesla's mass production of the Cybertruck is expected to begin in 2024. That's some exciting news. Uh, so let us know in the comments below if this is your first time watching our videos. If you want to see more videos like this, hit the notification uh, bell and stay tuned. Are you excited for the Cybertruck to be driving around? What is your favorite 